When a scoreboard service company technician instructs you to replace the module on your outdoor scoreboard, this video will show you how to safely and correctly perform this repair. The module is the computer and power supply for the entire scoreboard. Replacing the module is straightforward and relatively easy, as long as you have a few basic tools and a safe way to reach and open the access panel on your scoreboard. The tools you will need to replace the module in the scoreboard are a cordless drill, a quarter inch nut driver bit for your drill, and a few twist ties or rubber bands to keep the cables attached to the module from falling into the cabinet. You will most likely be performing the repairs or upgrades to your scoreboard while it is mounted in place at your facility. Use the appropriate ladder, lift, or scaffold. Be sure you're able to work safely with both hands free while you are working on the scoreboard. Before beginning any repairs, turn off the power to the scoreboard. The scoreboard module is accessed from the rear of the scoreboard and is typically located in the bottom and middle of the scoreboard. Your service technician will instruct you as to exactly where the module access panel is located on your specific scoreboard. Use a cordless drill and a quarter inch nut driver to remove the sheet metal screws holding the access panel to the scoreboard. Next, use the cordless drill with a quarter inch nut driver to remove the screws securing the module to the cabinet. Carefully remove all of the cables attached to the module. Use a digital camera or draw a diagram so you can reattach each cable correctly. Notice that several of the cables have red and black stripes. These cables need to be reattached into the specific port and oriented exactly as you remove them. Bundle the cables you remove from the module using a twist tie or rubber band and allow them to hang outside of the cabinet. Installing a replacement module is done in reverse order of the removal process. Rest the new module inside the cabinet with the cable port attachment label facing out of the scoreboard. Reattach each cable from the module cable bundle. Again, be sure to orient the red stripes and black stripes on the cables exactly as they were before you remove them. Printed on the edge of the module is a label to help you correctly reattach the cables. Now that each cable is reattached to the module, carefully slide the module into the guide rails. Screw the sheet metal screws back into the module, securing the module to the cabinet. Now reattach the cover to the access panel using the sheet metal screws. Next, turn on the power to the scoreboard. Use your controller to test for the correct operation of the scoreboard, including all digits, horn, and wireless connectivity. When the board is completely lit and you have total control of all functions and features on your scoreboard, you have successfully completed the module replacement. This repair should take 30 to 60 minutes. If you have a wireless internet signal at the scoreboard, and you have a smartphone, tablet, or laptop computer, you may find it helpful to review this video on site as needed. Consult your scoreboard service company technician for any questions or assistance during the removal and installation of the module. Scoreboard Service Company, 1-800-411-3136.